नमस्कार व्यूअर्स दिस इज डॉक्टर एस वी रामारो प्रिंसिपल साइंटिस्ट वर्किंग फॉर आई सी आर इंडियन काउंसिल ऑफ अग्रीकल्चरल रिसर्च एट डायरेक्टरेट ऑफ पोल्ट्री रिसर्च हैदराबाद वी आर वर्किंग ऑन वेरियस एस्पेक्ट्स ऑफ चिकन फार्मिंग बोथ बैक यार्ड एज वेल एज इंटेंसिव पोल्ट्री प्रोडक्शन हियर नाउ आई वुड लाइक टू discuss or share my views about certain issues of egg and chicken meat consumption recently several misnomers or myths or false information is being provided through mass media or social media so stating that egg and chicken production is not ethical one thing is chicken farming is highly scientific people everybody is wondering how a broiler is weighing for 35 days more than 2 kg how an egg is a one egg is produced every day there must be something some mischief that is being practiced malpractice is being followed so that's why they are getting very high production but if you really scientifically if you look at the poultry farming in our country is highly scientific highly technical so it starts with a development of a chicken variety with high production potential in case of layers we are getting almost 300 to 335 eggs in 365 days of age in case of broilers we are getting almost more than 2 kg at 35 days of age with feed efficiency of 1.5 so such a high production potential how we are getting it is one thing is by developing birds for high production potential through selective breeding that means they are we are selecting the population the selective population from a 1 lakh or 2 lakh of birds with high production potential and they those birds are being bred for developing a next generation like that generation after generation we are getting very high production potential once we have the bird with high production potential naturally we have to provide the best environment in terms of feeding in terms of health care in terms of management in intensive poultry farming it's not a wonder if i am telling the commercial the feed which we are giving to the chicken it is a blend of all the nutrients starting from energy protein essential amino acids essential fatty acids 13 vitamins both fat soluble and water soluble vitamins major minerals all trace minerals micro minerals which are highly essential by giving all these nutrients in a very highly balanced proportion then only the um, the performance of the bird is coming to the best it's no wonder if i am telling on meal to meal basis as a human being we are not able to consume such a balanced feed what we are giving to the intensive the red commercial broilers and layers best breed best variety and the best feed we have given but what next we need is provide is we are also giving the best protection from the viral as well as mycoplasma diseases from the chicken by giving almost close to 3 to 5 vaccines in case of commercial broilers meat producing birds and also we are giving almost 18 to 20 vaccines in case of commercial layers so then only they are able to sustain or protect themselves from the viral diseases whenever it happens in future the third and the most important thing is management unless the management is the best they can't produce its genetic potential 
management which includes the providing a proper biosecurity so once once we, we visit any commercial poultry farm you wonder how scientifically how the birds are being maintained by proper providing the proper biosecurity from the predators wild birds from trespassers and even within the farm also they the biosecurity is maintained to the highest level so that means by provide by having the good bird by providing the best feed by providing the proper health care vaccination by providing the proper biosecurity then only we are getting the best production it is not like giving the some steroids and giving some hormones or giving something mischief things those thing all those things are totally wrong and uh, we should not believe those kind of things the what the commercial egg or commercial meat what we are getting is out of the lot of scientific and technical efforts they have gone into it then only we got the best feed so friends i humbly request all the non vegetarian people don't have any prejudice about the safety and quality of eggs or chicken meat it is a blend of all the excellent not only protein which are helpful for building the muscles so it is also a very good source of phospholipids which are required for development of the brain as well as spinal cord and also all the body tissues and they are excellent source of vitamins and trace minerals which are essential for reducing the stress in our body and also enhancing the immunity so so that our body can fight with invading pathogens either it is viral or bacteria and please please enjoy again chicken meat and you please eat and provide to the kids and provide to the pregnant women and provide to everybody those who are meat lovers are egg lovers so that apart from increasing the their body healthy and also they can reduce their stress and they can also enhance the immune response in our body so that we keep we stay healthy forever thank you very much